It is now our pleasure to introduce to you the candidates for intermediate champion of the International Brown Swiss Junior Show. In the junior two-year-old cow class, there were five animals exhibited. The winning entry was 2005. She is Jen Lar Carter Waltz ETV, owned by Brianna Meyer of Chilton, Wisconsin. And the second place entry in that class was 1991. She's Trackside Java Cadillac, owned by Otis, Malcolm, and Quincy Johnson of Evansville, Wisconsin. In the senior two-year-old cow class, there were six animals exhibited. The winning entry is number 2020, Open Road C. Pepper, Who Is It?, owned by Amy Hughes of Killibuck, Ohio. And the second entry in that class was 2046, Red Bray Faust Lizetta, owned by Elise Black of Muscaday, Wisconsin. In the junior three-year-old cow class, there were two cows exhibited. The winning entry was number 2073. She is Top View Woods Push It, owned by Keaton and Kinley Top of Botkins, Ohio. In the second place in that class was 2052. She is Top Acres HPB Winning ET, owned by John Henry Hughes of Killibuck, Ohio. Ladies and gentlemen, your candidates for the intermediate champion of the International Brown Swiss Junior Show. Please join me in showing your appreciation for these fine animals and juniors in the center of the ring. We will now turn the microphone back over to Judge Wagner, who will now name his intermediate champions of the International Brown Swiss Show. Well, ladies and gentlemen, it's been a tremendous, tremendous young cow class show here this morning. Me and Chip have been uh, thrilled, <laughs> thrilled to death over it. I mean, top quality cows right down through. These juniors have stood right in the heat of things. Just beautiful mammary cows, beautiful udder, beautiful frames. I think these kids need a great big round of applause for the time that they've taken just to prepare these cows. These cows don't get ready overnight. I know that. And they've had a big round of applause and I think the parents need a big round of applause because it takes time, it takes money to put all this together. And I think everybody out here should just take a big congratulations. We talked about each one of these in our class. They're cows that are balanced, cows that are beautiful, mammaried. I'm going to have Chip go out. He will uh, select our intermediate, our reserve, our honorable mention. Please show your appreciation as we do so. And uh, we'll give our reasons why when we come back. For us today, I'll tell you, this pair of junior two-year-olds, wow, cows that have mammary systems like this as young cows, cows that stood right up there in their open show classes, but just tremendous, tremendous mammary systems. It's that quality and overall height and width that they carry through the rear udders that takes them over that junior three. Nothing away from the junior three, a beautiful dairy open frame cow. Cow maybe just doesn't quite have the snap that our first two cows have here. But intermediate champion on your junior two, reserve on your second place junior two, and then honorable mention on your junior three. Let's show them another great big round of applause. These kids have done just an outstanding job out here today. Your intermediate champion female of the junior show is number 2005. She is Jenlar Carter Waltz ETV, owned by Brianna Meyer of Chilton, Wisconsin. She is receiving an award presented by David Badula of Cassville, Wisconsin. Your reserve intermediate champion of the female show 
is number 1991. She is Trackside Java Cadillac, owned by Otis, Malcolm, and Quincy Johnson of Evansville, Wisconsin. She receives award by Maryland Br Brown Swiss Association. And both of these fine entries are receiving banners presented by Purebred Publishing, the Brown Swiss Bulletin of Columbus, Ohio, as well as rosettes presented by Second Look Holsteins, the Hodor family of Eden, Wisconsin. And your honorable mention is number 2073. She is Top View Woods Push It, owned by Keaton and Kinley Top of Botkins, Ohio. Congratulations to all of our juniors.